Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're watching a video about a white woman who identifies as black. This is going to be a bit of a weird one. I want everybody to take a look at a photo of my next guest, Martina, when she was a young teen. Okay, so as you can see, this is quite clearly a white woman. Keyword, white. However, we're eventually going to find out that she transformed from a white woman to a black woman. Now, at this age, Martina desperately wanted to look like Pamela Anderson. I mean, Pamela Anderson is a very beautiful woman. I don't blame you. If I were a girl, I wouldn't look like Pamela Anderson. Who do I want to look like? I don't know. I've been told apparently I look like Shawn Mendes. Personally, I don't see it. So after 10 years and several cosmetic surgery, Martina transformed her looks into this. I love the audience's reaction. That's like my reaction. Did you see the size of them boobs? I don't know why, but boob implants are so scary to me. Like, think of it. You're basically getting, I don't even know, like silicone shoved into your body. I'd just be scared of falling over and popping one of the implants. But she wasn't done. Six months ago, Martina made worldwide headlines. And not for a good reason. Basically for a bad reason. Basically, she came out as black and she got surgery and like injections to turn her skin dark. Yeah, I know it's crazy. Were there most Shocking transformation yet through chemical injections and body modification, Martina now considers herself a black woman. <laughs> Oh my god, you seen that, didn't you? I mean, if you looked at this from a distance, you certainly would think that's a black woman. I mean, the skin is obviously very dark. She's got gigantic boobs. I don't know how she's able to walk around with boobs that big. From as early as Martina Big can remember, she never felt comfortable in her own skin. I wanted to look like a Barbie. I want to create a more beautiful body. Okay, so whenever I think of Barbie, I usually think of a white girl with blue eyes, blonde hair, and very small boobs. Usually quite skinny. I don't know if this is Barbie. It's so Certainly ain't. I mean, it's not even a bratzel, is it? A lot of times these people are always like, oh, I wouldn't look like Barbie, but then they do the complete opposite. They get big lips, a big bum, big boobs. Honey, that ain't Barbie. Martina began to dream about having plastic surgery to look like her idol, Pamela Anderson. I look at Pamela Anderson in the media reports and I want to look like her. I mean, oh my God, did you see the size of them boobs? Yet again, they look like they're about to pop. I feel bad for her back because that must be very painful. But you know, she kind of does look like Pamela Anderson. However, I think the boobs are about four times bigger than hers. In 2012, I got very stretchy special bread implant. Had she got so much lip filler that it's stopping her from speaking English? I do think she is foreign, so maybe she has got a bit of an accent. I'm pretty sure like that lip filler is causing her not to be able to speak. I mean, I'm sorry, she doesn't look like a black person. She just looks like Jabba the Hutt. And also, I got a nose job. And I also had a liposuction to get long Barbie. Okay, so she's trying to get long Barbie legs. I mean, look at her. She looks beautiful in this. This just looks painful. Yet again, I feel bad for these people because, like, surgeons have just taken their money. She was so pretty beforehand, now she's completely ruined herself. But after spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on plastic surgery, Martina was ready for her most shocking transformation of all. Oh my god, you just seen the way her colour changed. Why do they even do that? I swear it is for, like, injections. But it's like some chemical you get off the black market. I've watched a few videos from people who are addicted to tan, and trust me, it's scary. I got three injections in my belly to change my skin colour, and now I'm the proud owner of a black skin. I mean, yeah, you might be black in the outside, but in the inside, you're still very much white. And also, she doesn't, like, look black. It's just, like, I don't know how to describe it. It just looks like a really dodgy tan. I feel bad for black people. Like, people like her need to leave them alone. Today, Martina says... She has changed her race, now identifies as a black woman. I mean, but that just isn't true or possible. Like, you can't identify as a black woman. You can't just wake up one day, snap your fingers and go, oh, I'm black. You can get surgery to look like a black person, maybe. I don't know, with like a BBL or like getting them injection. It might make you look black in the outside, but you're not black in the inside. You're still white. It's kind of like Ollie London where he gets all these crazy surgeries to look Korean, but like he just looks botched. Everyone, welcome Martina Big. I wonder if they're gonna be her. Oh, they are! Oh, and she just gives the thumbs up. Yet again, them boobs. Did you see the size of them boobs? Also, why is her name Martha Big? She underwent extreme body modification to transform herself from a white woman into a black woman. I mean, she definitely did go under extreme body modification, but it just looks painful. Take a look at this photo, Martina. No. Yeah. What was? Yeah. What's wrong with that woman? Nothing. She looks beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> I love how she's like, yeah, she's like beautiful, but I just changed her all. Oh my god, look at this difference. So this is her now. Black God's Rock. Wait, what does that say? All I can see is the word 
flat. But then that's her back in the day and that's her now. I mean, I don't know what's gone on, but something obviously bad has. I like myself, but I also like to do photos. But on the photos, I can see if you have the curves of Pamela Anderson, yeah. you, the photos would be much more, so, I mean, I don't think Pamela Anderson has got many curves, does she? She's got big boobs, but I don't know about a big bum. Oh my god, is this woman got bum implants? I don't even want to look at her bum. So you wanted to look like Pamela Anderson because you like her curves. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so then you became what you thought was Pamela Anderson. Yeah, but last time I checked, Pamela Anderson wasn't black, she was white. I mean, she looks white to me, however, she doesn't. But now, looking like Pamela Anderson wasn't enough for you. Yeah, I'm creating myself an extreme real-life Barbie. What, what? Real life Barbie? Yet again, they always go back to the Barbie talk. You don't look like Barbie. This does not look like Barbie. Like, I don't even know what this looks like. She doesn't even look like a black person. She just looks like Jabba the Hutt. What, what happened here? What, what, what did you do? I had uh, my, my main surgeries. I got a rhinoplasty. Yes. I got porcelain vernis on my teeth. Yes. I get my first... Oh my god, look at that photo. Wait a minute. Nah, I'm sorry. I don't feel like I should laugh at this. This is horrific. It just looks odd, doesn't it? Because it's like she got this real really bright hair. Has she tattooed her lips? And then these boobs just look so disproportionable. But I can't even pronounce that word. I'm not even trying to act smart. When did you get injections to look darker? In middle of January, I got three injections in the belly. And after the first week, you can see going darker, darker, and darker. Oh my God, look at all the reaction. Think of it, the majority of the audience is like mixed and black. I mean, these two faces are me. Like, I feel like everyone's like that. Technically, it's not illegal because like there's no law against it. But Marley, is it correct? No. I mean, she's getting injected injections in her belly to change the color of her skin that just screams dangerous to me martina do you think you're a black person yep <laughs> No, but you're just not. You got surgery to look like a black person. But you're not a black person. You're still very white. Spectrum wise, white white is here and dark black is here. She went from this side of the spectrum and just jumped to the other. I can't believe it. Like, I actually can't believe this. For 80%, I have to learn a lot. I know. Wait, you have to learn a lot? You're like 80% now, so she's not properly black, guys. She's not fully black. She's 80%. She's three quarters of the way there. I don't think that's how it works. Yet again, these people are just taking advantage of obviously this woman's got real issues because it's not normal to do this to yourself and we shouldn't accept it but, like people have literally taken her money to be able to do that to her here are these people that should be in jail you know martina everybody who's watching this who is a person of color are going to say it's not just skin deep i mean it's <laughs> Oh my god, wow, that audience is filled with people of colour. There's a lot of people of colour there. I wonder what they think. It's like, you can't just do that. A black person can't become white and a white person can't become black. It doesn't happen. Like, that's not... It... I don't know. I can't be asked. Do you think you want to learn about the black culture and you think you can absorb all that? I know. I feel a lot of this stuff. I you feel it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. But, but just because your skin is dark? No, beginning, I only wanted to have more tan. Yes. But when I got in my this injection, yeah, I like the contrast of long blonde hair. Yet again, they're showing that photo. I can't be asked with that photo. Like, if she wants to learn about black culture, I'm sure they've got no issue with that. Whatever the issue they've got is that the fact that she's literally getting injections to look black. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Yet again, this photo, like, this just, this, oh no, it just looks weird, doesn't it? Your husband, Michael, is here, isn't yep. he? Mm -hmm. Oh god, Michael, what's Michael like? Nice to see you. Something looks a bit off. I've got a feeling he's been in the injections. I have seen her on a UK program called This Morning. I didn't watch the video. But I'm pretty sure the husband also takes his hand in injections. I uh, mean, I might as well ask you. Do you feel black? I'm a medium. Uh, I have got a dark You're a medium. Body. Okay, so he basically means he's mixed. He's halfway there. I mean, his wife's 80% of the way there. I've got a question, but if them two have a child, is the child going to come out white, mixed, or black? I mean, at the end of the day, if they're getting injections to change the colour of their skin, their baby's gonna come out with 15 extra legs. These are some of the statements that you made to my producers, Martina. You said, it's better to be black, the feeling inside is just happier. It's better to be black, the feeling inside is just happier. I mean, maybe you do feel happier that you're black, but like, you literally were Pamela Anderson a year ago, and now you're a black woman. Yet again, this photo, I can't get over it. This actually looks like something you'd see in like, Little Britain. These injections are going to fade, aren't they? Uh, hopefully not. Also, also, in the previous cancellation, they say, 
three, um, in several months, they will go. Okay, so these injections last you a few months. So she's gonna have to get them, like, every three or four months. I mean, what happens if she gets them every day? She ain't gonna look black. She's just gonna look green. You also said, I am black. That is my race. I can't wait to go to Africa because I hear the food is tasty. <laughs> At this point, she's just digging herself into a hole. Look, I can completely understand being into black culture. I feel like everyone should be allowed to, like, look into different cultures. Just don't, like, make it your whole personality or, like, don't be inappropriate about it. And this right here is what she's done. She's been inappropriate. Do you think that you are offending people who were born black? I mean, she probably is going to say no, she doesn't think she's being offensive, which is the issue. Yet again, this woman, there's something going on. I feel like she needs therapy. I said every single time I watch one of these videos. Do you think you're offending anyone who is naturally Do you think you're offending those people? No. I, 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 don't, I, I don't want to affect them. I don't want to affect them. Thinking about it now, she does seem like a sweet person, but she just doesn't realise what she's doing wrong, and that's the issue. I can guarantee you she probably is a really sweet angel. Like, she seems like a really nice person to have a conversation with. However, what she's doing to herself is also damaging herself, but she's also, like, being offensive and damaging black people. It's like you can't just get injections and, like, change your hairstyle and become black. That's not what happens. I'm sure that it sounds... In, in your experience, you keep trying to find something. I'm sure there's going to be something else you're going to try to find in the future. Yet again, I'm telling you, Asian people, watch out because she's the next Ollie London. Imagine she becomes like Irish and like dyes her hair ginger. I mean, it wouldn't surprise me. But anyways, that's where I'm going to leave that video there. That is white woman who identifies as a black woman. This honestly sounds like something out of Little Britain because of the amount of stupidity we've just listened to. Anyways, if you are new, hit that big red subscribe button. And yes, I'll see you all in my next video.